Mitch Darren was on the radio this morning saying you got a couple offer sheets for this summer. Uh, how close were you to, to going down that path? Uh, I mean, at the, early in the summer, and you know, the whole goal of this would be a, a Maple Leaf, so uh, it wasn't in our head too much. Uh, as soon as kind of Darren mentioned it, just got uh, told him right away. You know, I don't want to explore that option, but uh, you know, like uh, like I said, I didn't want to miss training camp. I didn't want to miss any games this season, so. Uh, you know, I was, I was, that's why I really forced the issue with Kyle to make sure that uh, we get something done here to get me here. And uh, like I said, I'm happy it happened. So you, you asked for the sit down on Thursday? Yeah, well, I think it was mutual. I mean, uh, I know Kyle was asking as well. So, um, you know, I thought it was good. It, uh, you know, brought us face to face and, you know, kind of expressed both of our feelings. And, um, you know, it worked out in the end of the day. How difficult is that process when you're in the midst of negotiating with the Leafs and there are other offers coming in? Uh, I mean, you know, like I said, I kind of turned it down right away, so um, never really thought about it too much in my head. I kind of got rid of it, but you know, just the whole kind of waiting part and seeing what's going to happen, that's it's kind of the part you're just sitting at home and, you know, you keep hearing, you know, the discussions between the two. And um, like I said, that's why I wanted, that's I think why me and Kyle met is, you know, kind of clear the air and make sure that uh, we're talking to each other and we got to figure it out. Uh, I mean, it's hard. I was, uh, I live there, so um, you know, you, you ain't getting away no matter who you talk to, family, friends. They're always asking, so um, you know, it's uh, it's always in the back of your mind. But you know, usually you just try to get away down to a lake or something, or get out of the city for a little bit, and um, you know, kind of just clear my head through that. So many things had to fall into place four years ago for you to get here. I guess it's something you're not going to jeopardize to play for the squad, and obviously in your hometown. Yeah, um, I mean. Uh, you know, since day one, I've been super happy being here. It's it's been great, and, and you know now I'm happy that uh, we got that deal done. We can get to work now, and you know it seems together for a while. So we gotta make sure uh, those years we we make them we make them work. Mike was saying the other day that sometimes when you become a free agent, you're kind of curious with the process. You think it might actually be fun to a degree, but then if you're not a business guy, you don't always like business. Just did anything surprise you about the process? Like was it tougher than you thought, or how did you, how did you see it? Uh. I mean, I think it's it's always tougher than you think. Um, you know, you hear about it, but until you really go through it, yeah, I, I don't think you really understand what's happening and what's happening behind those doors. So, um, you know, that was the main thing is just, uh, like I said, keeping my mind clear, not listening to any outside noise. And, you know, no one really knew what was actually going on inside the room for the negotiations. So, um, you know, all that speculation draws a lot of attention in the fans. And um, for that, it was just, like I said, trying to get away and trying to stay clear of, you know, the city. and making sure that uh, when I had my time, I was getting away and you know, enjoying my time. And was there any validation to getting other offers? Because obviously you believed you know, what your value was, but then you, you find out, like, you know, yeah, there are teams that you know, want me and value me the same way. It can be a compliment in some ways. Yeah. I mean, uh, you know, obviously it was nice hearing that uh, you know, other teams valued me, but like I said, I mean, I knew, I knew this team valued me as well. Um, you know, our, in our four years of being here, I know, I know how much value they, they have in me and how much faith they have in me. So that was another reason why I want to come back to, you know, show that uh, they made the right decision and you know, that I made the right decision staying here. Were those offers you got worth more than what you ended up signing for? Uh, you know, I don't want to go into any of that. Um, you know, like I, like I kind of told Darren, um, yeah, I didn't really want him, so I didn't really ask too much, too many details about it. Um, but, uh, you know, yeah, not going to get into that.